Three ways to get financially fit in 2022. Let's talk about it. Hello everybody, Joe Werber coming at you. And 2022 is just about here. And if you want to have a great financial future, here are three very simple techniques that you can do right now to help increase your retirement accounts by hundreds of thousands, if not millions, and save you untold amount of taxes. Number one, give yourself a retirement raise. Now, what do I mean by that? Hopefully, you got a raise at your work. Maybe it was 3%, maybe it was closer to 6 or 7%. Whatever it was, you need to increase your contributions to your retirement accounts by the same percentage. Let me give you an example. If you're in your mid-30s and you're saving $5,000 a year in your retirement accounts, if you give yourself a 3% retirement raise every year, that's close to a quarter of a million dollars of more assets in your retirement accounts. Almost $250,000 more just by increasing your contributions by 3%. Now, if you're contributing $10,000 a year and you increase your contributions every year by 3%, that's over $400,000 of extra retirement cash and you won't even miss it because you got more income and if you do it immediately before you get your first paycheck you'll never even miss it you'll pay yourself first so that means if you know what your raise is right now pause this log into your 401k and increase your contribution by the same amount just multiply it by 1.0 whatever your raise was if your raise was five percent multiply your current contribution by 1.05. If your raise was 3%, multiply it by 1.03. That's how much you need to start contributing. And if you're getting paid every two weeks, that's 26 pays, divide that number by 26 and input that in your 401k. Do it now. Number two, make sure you're improving your credit score each and every year. I don't care if you wanna borrow money or not. There will come a time in the future when you wanna borrow money. So one of the things you can do, and you should do this every year, is you need to call your credit card company and request an increase on your credit limit. You don't want them to do a hard pull on your credit report. You want them to do a soft pull and just look at it. Now, some credit card companies will do this once a year. Some credit card companies will do this every quarter but get on the phone right now, write this down, call your credit card company and ask for an increase. Because what happens is if you have more credit available, but you aren't increasing your spending, your credit score goes up because you should be spending about seven to 8% of your credit every single month, no more than that. And the easiest way to do that without cutting your spending is to increase your credit limit, but you have to be disciplined and not go crazy. And number three, you know what I'm gonna say, I say it all the time on this channel, make sure you put your money into a Roth. I don't care how much income you're making, I don't care if you're making millions of dollars a year, if you're making tens of thousands of dollars a year, if you are saving for retirement, it should be in a Roth. I just sat down with a 25 year old gentleman who's in the Air Force, and we'll change his name, let's just call him Steve. Steve, you're doing a great job serving our country and saving. He's putting about $4,500 a year away. I ran the numbers for him. If he puts that money in the regular TSP, now if, if you're a veteran, you know what I'm talking about. TSP is the thrift savings plan that they offer. It's like a 401k for service members. He's putting $4,500 away. If he does it in the Roth versus the traditional pre-tax, are you ready for this? It will save him over three million dollars of taxes, assuming taxes never go up. That's insane. That means if he starts in his mid twenties, the guy's only 25 and he saves, it's only $4,500 a year. He saves that every year and he does it as a Roth versus an IRA over $3 million of savings because, and get this, had he stuck it in the regular account, he would have been pushed into the 28% tax bracket. And for those of you who know your taxes, a person, a single person making $45,000 a year is only in the 12% tax bracket. So had he not talked to me, he would be saving and not spending on those tax dollars at 12%, but waiting till he retired and, and then had to pay 28%. The Roth, he retires 100% tax free. We are talking about a massive tax savings simply by switching. So real quick, give yourself a retirement raise, ask your credit card companies to do a soft pull and increase your credit limits, and 
put money into a Roth. If you do this, you could save millions of taxes, increase your retirement plan by hundreds of thousands of dollars, and you won't even feel the pain. Hope you have a great 2022. Make sure you subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Comment down below for ideas for future videos, and I will see you all next year.